What's good fam, John and Sam back on the cam and today we are checking out the trailer for Avatar, The Way of Water. Let's do this. That looks sick. I'm liking the music. Looks like they've changed the nose a little bit. Let's look at those visuals though, man. It looks beautiful. That water. Alright, so I think that looked quite sick, man. What about you? Yeah, I think visually it looks absolutely stunning. Um, CGI. Yeah, because uh, one of the big things about the first Avatar film was the visuals. Yeah. It was very well done, especially for it being a 2009 film. It was the first time we saw a lot of the CGI like technology incorporated with the actual characters themselves, right? right. Um, and they pulled it off amazingly. And they did the same with like all the landscaping, like the way the, um, Pandora looked. Mm. Um, and now with them going into the water and those water shots looked amazing as well oh yeah it looks absolutely fabulous yeah man i'm not sure whether i noticed a bit of a, a bit more of a greeny tinge to the skin it, it doesn't look as blue as last time i'm not sure we'll, we'll have to see whether they've done that as a way of like i don't know maybe the sun reflecting on their skin and giving it a bit of a greeny hue i'm not sure possibly uh some of the details looked a bit different with the face as well the nose looked a bit more animalistic mm. um on that first shot and there seems to be something with a little Tarzan kid running about we saw. Someone who looked a bit feral and wild. Of course, Avatar as well was one of the biggest grossing films of its time. It actually knocked Titanic off the top spot yep. 12 years after it was released. And it held that title for six years in the domestic box office until Star Wars Force Awakens yeah. knocked it off. Uh -huh. uh, but highest grossing film of all time worldwide, mm -hmm. it still has that top spot at about 2.8 billion. Yeah, James Cameron smashing it, mate. And obviously he held Titanic for like 12 years as well, so yeah. James Cameron beat James Cameron, so he could pat himself on the back twice. Yeah, and now <laughs> Disney is beating Disney. <laughs> yeah, because they are an avatar. <laughs> We said it before, yeah, of course you're going to win the race if you're the only one running. Yeah. <laughs> but when I went on to Disney World in Florida, they actually have a Pandora section okay. in the Animal Kingdom. Yeah. It actually looks like they've got like, the floating islands and stuff. And oh. yeah, there's a ride there called the Flight of Passage where you actually get to go on one of the bird things. Yeah. And you sit on this like little bike and it like straps you in <laughs> and it's all like 4D kind of thing. All right, then. So, you know, it's like you're flying around and it like goes down when you go down and goes up and you Does get Does it look good when you're actually on it? Oh, yeah, definitely. Oh, that sounds sick. Like, it was such an amazing experience. It was so good. We actually, me and my missus, we went on it twice. Twice? Yeah. But the line through it was two hours long. <laughs> so we had to get there, like, first thing to get on. <laughs> you could have watched most of the first Avatar film whilst you was waiting. <laughs> Pretty much, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that was us reacting to Avatar 2. Let us know in the comment section below if you're looking forward to the film, any thoughts and opinions that you have on it, and we will see you for the next one. Peace. Peace.